Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29 and here's what's in our backpack. Uh, we're underweight. Uh, look at that. I like these books. I'm gonna make sure I read these books, but I'm not dropping that one because it's a... That's a long book. That's 20 hours. Uh, we need a bandage. A bandage. One bandage. Um, you know what? I'm gonna repair these just to make sure they don't ruin. There you go, 30%, that'll work. We're gonna repair some other items too, but for the time being. Uh, where we go? Sport bow is at 51, you're at 71. Our hatchet needs to be repaired. I don't have two knives, okay, good. Uh, I'm gonna drop the flares, I think. And we got 13 and seven, okay all good and we are day 193 and here's our skills mending is ever so slowly I, I i wonder once we do about four or five more repairs how that's gonna work out all right and we're just at the wee stages of the morning cooked uh you are boiled 47 minutes do that and let's throw that on there. 57. Throw a stick. You're 57, you're 56. Actually, we need an hour 24 on that, anyway, right? There we go. Alright, let's uh let's do some repairs to clothing we're actually wearing. Hey XM, welcome in. I would ask you how you're doing, but I see that you said you're good, thanks. So I will just say welcome in. Good to have you, as usual. Hope you're doing... Hope your day is going well, or your night, whatever you're... I think you're in night, or evening. Forgive me if I'm wrong. I usually am. <laughs> Alright, you're at 100. At 13 minutes, you are cooked. Let's just speed that up. Uh, I'm leaving that there. You know why? Because I know a place that has a guaranteed two pots. You all are going to learn something today. I'm going to teach you. I'm going to take all of those. I'm taking all of my stems. I'm not leaving them. Um, oh, damn it. I gotta take the revolver. You're not actually gonna learn anything unless you learn from my mistakes. <laughs> Put that there. Put that there. I don't care that they're backwards. It doesn't bother me at all. What are you at? 51, you're good for a while. Uh, you're 40. You're alright. Uh, Darth's played two demos that are obviously a ripoff of the Long Dark. One was good, the other wasn't. What were they? I'm interested. I've, I've always looked for knockoffs because sometimes, you know, sometimes a knockoff will take uh, the ideas that the community had and implement that into the game. And maybe as a whole, the game isn't as good because it usually never is, but it might be just good enough to satisfy you a little. Uh, we need to eat and drink. Oh, the one you liked is permafrost. I tried playing permafrost. You know what happened though? I got, I mean, obviously it's, it's very early in its stages, but um, I had an issue. I'm taking these gloves. 
You know that? Because I don't have spares. They are half a kilogram. Um, yeah, I had an issue where I just kind of got messed up and I couldn't go any further. What are you at? 78. I'm going to take the lantern fuel. I'm going to... I have to take those. Because we have no clue what the cougar is going to bring, right? We don't know if those are going to still be a thing. Let's just go. Uh, I'm trying to remember the scenario I was in in that in permafrost. Um, what was it? Oh, I was freezing. I was freezing. I was freezing. That's what it was. I was freezing. And I went to try to make a fire because when I was freezing, I couldn't move. And I went to try to make a fire and it wouldn't allow me to make a fire anywhere where I was. I'm like, well, this is kind of stupid now, isn't it? <laughs> But that game's still very, very, very early. So obviously one day that'll get fixed. That's the, that's the downside of playing early access games like that. Is you're going to encounter stuff like that. They, yeah, they did put an unstuck in there, which is good. That's a smart move for early access games. But yeah, I just, eh, I'll wait a little bit longer. All right. I know of a place that has two pots. Two of them. And luckily, it's kind of on our way. Uh, we got one moose already. We're going to check for the other one. I believe there can be three out here. We're going to check for the other moose, but I I seem to have left my, my pots in that cave. So it's kind of, I mean, I think normally when I leave, I would just be leaving this way. Uh, this time we kind of have to go that way. Actually, let's let's go this way first, and we'll warm up in the trailer, and then we'll head out that way. It's it's kind of on the way out, so it's not like the worst thing ever. But don't leave your pots. <laughs> don't leave them. I want to check real quick. Mm, mending. A little bit more. I'm going to grab some sticks. The other game was called Short Snow. That one I've not heard of. And that was the one that sucked. It needs a lot of work. Is that one just like extremely early access? And maybe it one day can be good. The one, the one long dark knockoff, I think that's the closest to the long dark is among trees, but I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. I honestly think that the game was at a difficulty that a five-year-old can play it. It has so much potential, but the developer's like, nah, I'm done. It was like the long dark in the summer. Same art style and everything. Like most people have seen it by now. That's disappointing. You get you get such potential in a game and then the developer's like, yeah, time to move on. No, it's not. Your game is not hard at all. 
What do they have in that among trees? They have bears, I think it is, but you don't even have to encounter them because they just stick around in their one little area. And the stuff that's in that area, you can get everywhere else. Doesn't matter. That's how you felt about Short Snow, very unfinished. Well, as long as the developer sticks with it, I'm going over here because I had pretty decent success with crossing. Uh, what do we have for feathers? 24. Strangely, I don't have an urge to have 27. <laughs> uh, 27? Oh my. Wow. What happened to me? That number I like is 29, it's not 27. Who likes 27? What's wrong with me? I'm gonna just lie to y'all and say like I woke up way too early today. I didn't, but I'm gonna pretend I did. Hey, Murd, how are you doing, bud? Welcome in. Murd sneaking in ninja style. <laughs> 27 are you having a stroke blink twice if you are I know right how do you screw up your own favorite number oh hello how did I not get you I know why I wanted her to be fresher so I left her here knowing I was coming back hello hello you look lonely why don't you come with me Gotcha. All right, normally I would keep, uh, my new rules are basically keep the stuff in the, the region that you found them, but I'm taking that with me because we're leaving the region unless we have another moose up ahead in the birch area. And that might change our plans, but if there is no moose there, we've already got one. I'm going to get the pots now. Or is the cave? That one. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing, kind of. I kind of have an idea. For some reason, I think the cave I want is over there. But the other thing is, I don't remember that there's two caves over here. So we'll see. We'll see. I'll know if there's a cave up here that has no pots in it. I'll come right back. I'll get them. And the whole time I'll be thinking up something to tell you. That'll justify me doing this. Jeez, this is cold. Naifo can't even get his favorite number right. I think he might have found the wrong pot. Hey, I'm not going to lie. My neighbors are potheads. And they're outside a lot. Sometimes the wind shifts. There we go. Murd had me all second guessing myself. Mine. Mine. Uh... Let's eat and drink. Let's drop that. Uh, you know what? It's only cloth. I got to do so. Oh, I guess I could have read the book. 
What am I thinking? Oh, now I got... I have a lot of sewing kits on me, though. That's a good thing, right? Oh, wow, I have six. Hmm. All right, I have 92 and 78. Oh, hey, dude, I keep forgetting. I got to sharpen you up. There we go. We're warm. 94. This should, I get, think this should go to 99, right? Yep. All right, let's go. Oh, now it's foggy. I don't want fog. I want clear skies. It's, it's not... Is it actually clearing up, though? I mean, we can see quite far away. Yeah, it might be okay. Yeah, coach comes by when he's able. Comes by, brightens our day. Who knows, maybe he'll stop in today. One piece of uh, this stuff. Yeah, birch bark. We have one. Well, we should find a couple up here. Oh, damn it. Switch. how you do it people take notes <laughs> no that right there is called I got real lucky I'm gonna keep this out I'm not sure if there was just that wolf over there or if there's another one Today's word is coagulate. That's kind of weird looking over here. What is that? Is it just a tree? I can't even pronounce the pronunciations because that one, the K-O-H, I'm like, ka. <laughs> Luckily, I knew the word. The change from fluid into thickened mass. Yeah, isn't that black pudding? Ugh. The change from a fluid into a thickened mass to curdle to congeal. Ugh. Leftover your oatmeal too. No, that turns into a rock. <laughs> Alright, we got a hunting blind over there, but we gotta check this way. Cause we got those kind of trees up ahead. We might have a moose. This is a moose area. Uh, 
Let's see. We got one bar of scent. Ah. Look what we have. Look at what we have. And we have you. We have you. Uh, I'm going to go up here just to see. There might be one. Who knows? Uh, maybe not. There's one. There's another. Fried jello. <laughs> Hello, look at you. Hey, who did that? Murd. Thanks for that, Murd. think that was a moose area. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, we got a completely hunt empty hunter's blind. Nothing. Ooh. Hey, Darth. I must replenish. There we go. 29. We got nine. Oh, go figure. Go figure. Is there any chance that it'll allow me to spot one more? I don't know. I don't see any, so... Well, there's one more hunting blind, right? I believe it's straight out that way. I might be wrong. I think there's three out here. This one's that one. And then uh, this one, which is usually a little bit difficult to get to. For me, anyway. We run? Yeah, we can run. Where's... Where's all the moose? We got one. So I'm not going to complain, but... down right here I guess I think this is thin ice nope I think it's wrong wow well I'm glad he was far away because I'm not I'm not doing too good on yanking out the bow I think it's just over to our right. Or am I wrong? Is it over there? I don't even see it. Is 
There she be. That's where we're going. I thought it was a little higher up. You know how cool that would be if you could fish right here. Casing, got some matches. Well, it's not that great, but it's way better than what we got at the last one. I'll try and get on this tree. Surely you can get a. Yeah, we should be able to, yeah? There we go. make sure I had my bedroll. Never hurts to double check. Oh, did I just ruin my crossing? <laughs> I thought I could drop down onto that other limb and continue crossing, but apparently can't. Let me grab these sticks. And I think I'm going to cross right over here. Out here. Run! There we go. We're good. Go there, go there. Nine days. That's respectable, isn't it? Let's go in this cave, we'll warm up, and then we'll go. The exit's over there. I'm not lost. Don't worry. But we can run, I guess, right? Not even been in this one. It's got a bed and a bag. Nice. All right, I've already switched that over. I'm going to drop all the meat and let's read the book for an hour. There we go. Eat that. Nine days is respectful for you, not for you. And your thousand day run. <laughs> hey. I'm more than willing to continue the run. And show you up. Not in this one, though. We don't have moose. I wouldn't mind doing, like, a lengthy run, but... Oh, man, I still remember that one run before I started capping my limits. It took, like, literally over a year of my life. On that run. That is a long time. I don't even remember what day I got to on that one. Oh, I fell for it too. I don't even think there's regular wolves out here. <laughs> Good one, copper. I should look for a timber wolf sound alert. I don't know if there is one or not.
Oh, you didn't even hear that one, Mert? I heard it. That's Twitch being Twitch. Hmm. We can just sleep in the bunker. It's either sleep in the bunker or sleep in the cave. How about we sleep in the bunker? Here's my reasoning. I'm not sure I can carry much more. If we sleep... Here, I'm getting rid of you. If we sleep in the bunker, we can check for that other moose in the morning. I'll pick you guys up. And I will drop you right here. Um, I have no reason to go to a bed. I'll just read this till it says you can't read no more. Oh, we almost got it all. Oh, well, we'll get it in the morning. Darth still doesn't hear the wolf sound alert. That's weird. Triple chocolate swirl ice cream is what Murd's. I like chocolate. I don't like it that much. What's the time? We can do that. Oh, I keep forgetting. I gotta look for a box. I can throw that. Uh... Let's throw you down. Hey, gunsmithing three. What's the time of day? I need a box. Or a container of some sort. Oh, there's the beds right there. I didn't realize. Sorry. I just slept on the floor. Making sure that none of those are anything that are important. I'll fill the belly. Let's go. I wonder if I can drop any of this here. Yeah, now we can check if there's. Who knows, maybe this moose has spawned, right? How many sticks do I have? Oh, Murd, look at that. I have 13 sticks. All right. Let me know if any of you see a moose. Possible one could have wandered in. Go down here. And a run across here. And if we don't see one, we'll just continue to leave. That was Murd purring. Um, uh, I don't think I have any spare. Yeah. Yeah, they've. Okay. Um, yeah. That's fine. Rose hip and Raishi. I wanted to see if I had, like, any extras that I couldn't make, but was just carrying. 
Uh, I'll go up here so we can get a better look if the moose is there. I don't want anybody saying, you didn't go close enough. Uh, let's just go right over in there. I think if there was a moose out here, we would see it. Already, but I don't see it. I just keeping a lookout and a listen out for those uh, those other timber wolves. I don't know if there was only one wolf remaining or if I just didn't see the other one. Alright, we should get a good look down here. Maybe I'll even get lucky and I'll see like a piece of birch bark and then I won't have an odd number. I can't feel my feet. Oh Astrid, if it's not one thing, it's another. Well, I'm gonna say there is no moose out here. So we're just gonna get ourselves out of here. This moose has a large area. They can be around the birch forest. Oh, the... You know what? I wonder where they're going to move my Timberwolf Mountain moose to. The, the one that stomped me. I'm not going to know who to, uh, who to fear anymore. I'm freezing. Are you an alert? Copper. Okay, thank you for your lurk and uh, hope you feel better. Thanks for saying hello. Get inside and warm up. And how much do you think we'll find? We have six. I'm going to say we're going to find nine. Which means if we find nine, I win. And if we find zero, I'm going to pretend I was speaking German. Well, we got two. Merch says 13, Darth says seven. Whoops, whoops. Lazy finger. Do I go that way or do I go this way? Which one of these is a dead end? We just came through there, right? I would like to take the path that goes to the dead end so I could search for more coal. But we will just take this one and be happy with it. Sam chose number nine as well.
We should make a rule that if I choose a number and somebody chooses to take it as well, they get it. Because I have 29 is my number that nobody's allowed to take. I will concede to to XM's. Oh, hey, 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 I think I'm on the right track. There we go. There we go. Oh, XM's gonna choose 11. You can have 9 if you want. I think 11 actually might be closer though. That might be a better number. I'm going this way. For this reason. At two. That should be the exit, right? I don't know that we'll find any more from here. We found 13. So we had, oh, we found seven. Who picked seven? Oh, Darth. Darth chose seven, you win. Darth wins my respect for the day. <laughs> Would you like to give a victory speech? <laughs> Here, that's for you. The celebratory cattail. Uh, let's actually fill our belly. Fill the bladder. And we'll go. I can carry much more. Uh, we've spent five days out here. Uh, Got a Polaroid. I, I'm going this way. I'm going to go this way. I don't think that I've actually. I just heard a very low groan. Kind of like what you hear when there's a moose. I don't know that this is a moose area though. It could just be the wife doing something upstairs that came through my headset. It's you and me, boy. You and me in this terrible fighting terrain. Oh, you took my barrel. Bad wolf. Yeah, I'm going this way because I... I hmm. Where... About... I, I gotta go out there. I think it's in the door. In the, the... You know where I'm talking about. When you go across. And there's that... Uh, the little cabinet. Is that where the deer pants memento is? It's gonna suck. I don't want to have to lug those things around. The broken hut with the cabinet. I was right. You believe so? Yes. Nice. I remembered. Yeah, because I'm thinking with, with with being here for five days, that doesn't seem long enough to have actually searched everywhere. I know I searched the bunker. I 
know I know we spent some time at the uh, whatever the, the the little whatever place that's called where the forge is but I may not have done a proper stay which means um, I know one moose spawn. I don't know if there's a second out here. I think. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. I know of one. I don't know if there's more than one. Let's put you away. Uh, I do think we're we're gonna go to the camp office, uh, drop off that uh, revolver. And maybe maybe drop off some curables. Speaking of the next run and with doing a longer run, I should do a minimum of 29 days for all regions, excluding places like Transfer Pass. You know what we should do? 29 days in every region, but no more. So that when you go into here and you get, you line these up, it just says like 29 all the way down. Except for obviously transfer pass and that. That's not going to happen though because I don't know. Um, I don't know which, which route to take. So if I get 29 days in a region, I don't know like. Well, I, if I go there and then I come back through it, is it going to turn that number to 30? But, yeah, I don't know. 29 days in the region's a long time, though. 29 and done challenge. <laughs> ah, dang it. Why can't my favorite number be 3? You think you guys would still watch if I was doing 29 days in a region? I can call it 29 days later. Like the zombie movie, but like one more. Let's drop you. Uh, where's... I got coal right here. Oh, 13 pieces of coal, Mert. I didn't even notice that. Alright. Stuff I'm going to take when we leave. Oh, there's my meat. You are finished. Throw you up there. You would watch, but I have to do 29 days straight. I'm going to leave that knife. We'll see. We'll see. My, my fear with that is like, I don't know where stuff is, right? Like I don't look at loot tables or anything. So. I don't know I'm going to get uh, a bedroll in the region I start in. So that's that's my problem with spending that amount of time in, in a region. I'll drop you. Uh... 
That should be fine. Oh, we're we're gaining temperature. Oh. Where is it? You, you must do 29 days straight or can leave and come back to top it off. Oh. I, I think... Uh, well, I think, yeah. For, I think for my map knowledge and such, I think I would have to leave and then come back and finish it up. Or, or I could cheat a little bit and just get the basic items, right? Like get it. Oh my, I thought that was the bear right there. I thought that thing right there was the bear. Um, I can get like the bedroll. Um matches hatchet knife and then do 29 days in a region but that might be boring I'm gonna say that that would be terribly boring for people to watch I think I don't know people on YouTube who are watching let me know your thoughts on that, because I don't know. Would you watch a person spend 29 straight days in a region and then go spend 29 more days in a different region? Imagine being in Bleak Inlet. I couldn't. I, I, I struggled to squeeze five days out of Bleak. I didn't even get five. Oh, I got nine. Oh wait, no, that was that was that wasn't bleak. Where was it? Desolation point. Once you take out the bear, you're like, okay, what do I do now? I couldn't even hang on for five days out there before it started boring me. Turn wolves up to to stalker level. You know what? I think if I did a run like that, I might just play a full blown uh, difficulty, right? Like stalker. I went past the memento. Oh, it's in the yeah. Because I'm still. I mean. Playing these custom runs, I don't get any of them showing up in my statistics. And I don't want to do a full-blown, a run like that. I don't want to do full-blown interloper. That would just put me to sleep and frustrate me to no end. Oh, there's the bear. There she be. Just play Fortnite. <laughs> uh, I I missed the boat on Fortnite a long time ago. I don't even know how you play it. Like I don't have a clue what the rules are. Do I have scent? I do have scent. Let's see how far or how close we can get this bear. What's the time? It's midday. Kind of preferring to get uh, a moose, but we can get a bear too. Ah, sneaky. There she be. Shoot everything is the rule. There they are. There's the pants. It, you know what'll be fun is uh, 
Hey, bro. You don't smell me? What'll be fun is when Hinterland... This is going to be a while before they do it. But when they changed the custom settings, they said they were going to add a lot more options. That would be... Interesting. Is that far enough? No, that's not far enough. Go on, Astrid, give it your best shot. I'm all out of rocks now. Yo. I'm here. I have scent. I'm gaining temperature, though. That's a good thing. I don't want to eat, but I'm going to... Well, let's eat that. Those energy bars are pretty good. That's disgusting, Murk. <laughs> you don't think you could have found a way of saying that a little bit less disgusting? <laughs> yeah, he can't come direct to us because that is the thin ice, that's true. We should have some cured hides and guts in the bunker. Yeah, I think you're right. I think he is coming to us. It's just, it was just thin ice over there, so he couldn't. What confused me, though, is when he had originally turned around. How about we do a stretch? Feeling stretchy right now. I'm in the position. I've assumed it. There we go. Oh boy, we think alike, Merd. Thanks. Is this guy still pathing to me or is he going somewhere else? Ooh, XM wants coffee. Okay. I'm going to see if sitting in a different... Here, I'm going to face... Here we go. go you got like a double slurp out there because one of them the first one almost choked me and i had to swallow thanks xm he's not coming to me he's going to my last oh, he, he's going to where he smelt me last bruh get over here i hit you with one of these rocks dang it there we go. This bear's like, sorry, someone shot my mom when I was a baby, so I didn't have anybody to teach me. He just lost interest again. Oh, he's coming. He's getting close enough that I can hear him. Oh, beautiful. Do you dare me? Is this stupid? It's five minutes. Watch him. <laughs> that might have been worse if he was uh, coming our way.
there we go. Now he's seen us. Come on, buddy. This is beautiful. I love the fact it's plus three. What I don't like is doing this when you're like, oh man, he's taking forever and we're going to start freezing and losing condition. I'm going to pull that out. You have shot his mom, dad, uncle, and... <laughs> Brother, sister, girlfriend, maybe boyfriend, neighbor. Let's go. Should I aim at him? Oh, that. I don't know. Was that short? Or is that far? see because of the grass I'm a hide you know what pick up some more meat come on bro I think I hit him. There we go. I think I had three. Boom headshot! Boom headshot! Boom headshot! Alright, I'm gonna take that. I got that. So I missed twice, right? I think. Where's his foot trick? I must have missed high. I thought I was missing low. Oh well. Got my arrows. What bear is that, by the way? Bear 20. Well, um, I'm not, you know what, let's set up the travel. Or let's not. Was it maybe on him? And that's why it wasn't, uh, make sure I don't have anything. Let's take you guys for sure. We don't really need the meat. I have a hacksaw on me. What the hell I got a hacksaw for? Look okay, at we're still gaining temperature. This is good. So you and you. And move you a little bit right there yeah now it's five only nine more bears until my number yes yeah I've had that hacksaw forever and yes I did repair it What else did I repair? Didn't I repair my knife? Is that why my knife was so high up? Where is my knife? There's that one. Where's my other knife? 
Did I drop it up there? I must have dropped it up there. Yes, I did. Yeah, I really don't know why I'm carrying this hacksaw. I don't know. I'll leave it at... Uh, I, I, I want to say the camp office, but honestly, that's not my base. My base is, if I have a base, is the trapper's cabin. Are we going to get a whole bear without having a fire? 22. Let's go 11. That way we'll do one more at 11. We'll leave that point whatever. I do want to eat and drink though. Oh, hey, look at that. I grabbed a little one. That's okay. There we go. Plus three. Yeah, look at that. We're going to harvest the entire bear. Minus, minus that point eight. I don't care about that. Get the whole thing without even making a fire. And if we're lucky, maybe we'll get an Aurora and we can go looking for a cache. Oh, I really want to do more of that. Let's pull you out. I was considering not using the sled for this, but at the same time, I thought, you know what? It's just easier. Uh, all right. Do that. I can't carry this any further. I'm gonna drop all these right here. Uh, we'll go up to the bunker so we can get those curing. Take you. We need some meat. And is there anything else I need? Uh, you're not going to let me. There we go. I got that. Um, I think all of this stuff can stay here. You can go there. Yeah, there's my good knife. Well, maybe we won't get an Aurora. It's not as clear as I was hoping, but you never know. You still feel that it's so inefficient not cooking whilst harvesting. <laughs> I know because when you harvest, um, and cook at the same time on a bear, you're going to end up with at least eight pieces that are cooked in that time, right? So, yeah, I don't, I don't at all disagree with what you just said, but for some reason I was more excited about being able to harvest a whole bear without requiring a fire and not freezing. But at the same time, that would have been the best time to do it because I wouldn't have had my fire blow out either. It looks weird. I'm not sure if it'll let me read like a full hour. It might. All right. I'm pretty
pretty sure. Yeah, I was I was pretty sure that we had some stuff in here. Uh, I got two cured deer hides. Drop you. Damn, I love that. I can moan about a lot of things, but you know what? It's only fair to not moan. And that thing works awesome. I love, whoops. I love that you can just, oh man. If I had another one, I could make it like there and we'll have like a, a carpeted hallway. I didn't have any guts in here though. That's terrible. Well, what good are those if I don't have any guts? You're plus two. I'm using my own. Does it degrade yours when you use it? Actually, I want to check something out. Uh, where are you? Right there. You're at 64. Oh, son of a bugger. Oh, well. I'm going to save that for the morning. Let's do that. Uh, actually... Yeah, we got our full rest. Uh, it's, wow. Still early. And we're out of water. Only got zero four left. Uh, we're gonna have to go down that to the bottom. His own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. Astrid, I have asked you a hundred times. Keep that to yourself. There is other people present. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm going to take the birch saplings. We'll go down here. Uh, we'll get some water on the stove. And maybe make some... Uh, what do you call them? Arrow shafts. I might even... It's only minus one on the wind. I might not even use the stove. I might just make a couple of fires so I can get four liters of water on the go. On one fire. And a couple pieces of meat on the other fire. You know that positive, every positive in the game has a negative? I love that the... In order to have the carcass remain, you can't take it all. That's the negative, that's the positive and the negative. You have this. If you want that to stay, which I don't know if, if some people just don't want it to stay, but you want that to remain as long as possible you cannot take it all. Cedar, cedar. I'm gonna take two of those. Um, I can not make a fire up here, right? No chance. Oh, could you? That would be so cool. I guess it wouldn't do it anyway, though. If it, even if it could, it wouldn't because of the book. No. And this is a wood surface, so it'll say no. But we can make them down here. Can we make it under here? No. I think I've tried this before. It's 
It makes sense. I mean, you'd burn the entire place down. Uh, where do I want to make my fires? Where? That's a good spot for one of them. We'll put water on this one, I guess. Come on, little fire. Come on. Um, I think that's kind of wind blocked. What did I light it with cedar for? I shouldn't have. Um, something I want to do. Let's move these. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break down that crate and see if I can get a fire there. I might have to move those out of the way. Oh, no. It's not going to work. I need something to drink and soon. Drink your pee, freak. Put you all right here. Well, I don't know that this tool case is going to help me with the wind, but I'm going to do that. Yeah, starting the fire in here on, with the sin with the with the cedar was kind of stupid because. I don't know if I need the fire to last that long. I'm going to drop the cedar right here. And... What's that spray paint? What the hell is spray paint doing right there? Put you right there. You're 86. Now I'm wishing I would have rotated that a little bit. 11 till melted. Do I have any drinks that I can... You know what? I can just drink that for now. Um, I can make more. I'm going to make some of these. And we're all good there. What do we got? An hour ten. Forty-five. Uh, I gotta drop the reclaimed wood, though. I only picked it up so I can move it out of the way. And the coal. Let's bring the coal over here, I guess. Do that. And I have just one stick. You're 0.8, 9, 10. That's like 20. Actually, that's almost 30 on the matches. Uh. Let's do that. I think it looks like it goes that way. Throw you right there. That's empty. Right, how are you doing? 30 minutes. 34. No scent. Oh, I wanted to... Uh, Arrow shafts. 30 minutes for three, I guess. Let's do it. Looks like I made it through another night. Put you right there. Put you. That'll work. Drink up. 
Um, what do I want to make here? I'll make two herbal tea. I'll make two birch bark. And I'll make some more water. All right, that should be enough for outdoors. 34 minutes. Arrow shaft. It's not giving me an option to switch what I'm using. Am I missing something? Oh, damn it. What am I missing? Making arrow shafts is 30 minutes. Oh, son of a bitch. I made arrows, not arrow shafts. No wonder it didn't give me a thing right here. And, oh man. Oh, bugger. Oops, my bad. And did I just make one arrow, obviously? Yeah, because I figured with arrow shafts, I only had Oh man, I was so confused when I was like, wait, why is the water boiled? That only takes 30 minutes. That's not... Time isn't working on that. What's the time of the day? Let's do that. What do we got on you? 50 minutes, 46. I should be fine. Arrow shaft. There we go. Oh man. Yeah, and the reason that I messed it was because the previous time I when I came here I didn't have any arrow shafts so I couldn't make any simple so it just didn't oh man how many arrows are we able to make oh we're able to make six hours worth for four well we're obviously not making arrows um we got 32 now what are you, 13 minutes let's do this and get going Uh, I don't know. That's 57. That's at 20. I'm going to leave those there. I don't know. 29 till boiled. Take that. I don't need all this water. Fill the belly. I bet you that meat actually should be pretty close. 22 until ready, two minutes. Eh, what the hell. Okay. It didn't cook. That's okay. Uh, I'm going to leave that. I'm going to take all this stuff and we're going to go. a little bit more water I think that's enough let's double check everything in here and everything looks good oh except that scrap metal I don't need that and what is our pry bar at 97 is good. All 
right. Well, I'm not... I'm not interested in going that way. I'm gonna go this way. Man, and I could have salvaged one of those pieces of meat too, right? Is your your brain is expecting certain words to appear there, so like you glance over and you're like, oh okay. It's like one minute to be ready, but I'm not clicking on a one minute to be ready. So I'll just wait it out. But it was actually a one minute till burnt. <laughs> one minute till crispy. Yeah, we're gonna get the memento. I just, uh, it's not that one though, right? It's the one up here. You got one bar of scent. I'm gonna walk out with the bow out. Just because I'm not having one of those good days where I'm just thinking properly. I'm having one of those days where I'm like, hmm, pull out your bow. Oh, wait, I forgot I had a gun. And then I gotta wait. <laughs> well, let's just do this. Yeah, we're going to get the deer pants. The problem is, well, that'll put us at like 54 kilograms. I think that's still walkable speed. up here with scent I, I've never been attacked that I can remember but I just feel that it's it's a very risky thing I, I can see now so I'm not not walking with the bow up that's how you hurt yourself man oh we gotta check for a moose too We do have to kind of look for a moose. The problem is the moose is, if I'm remembering correctly, it's all the way across that way and that way. If I remember correctly, am I wrong? Because it's over by Hat Creek and then you go up on that ridge. That's the moose I know. That's that moose I hit that I didn't even realize. But, well, I I was hoping I could actually hit it, but then I actually dropped it. You're tired, XM? You're gonna lurk? Okay, thank you. Thank you so much for the lurk, and thank you for uh, coming in and saying hello. What is that? Oh, that's that wolf I took out earlier. <laughs> you don't even know which moose I have here. I don't... Well, like I was saying earlier, I don't know the other moose spawn out here. I mean, I know that one. Uh, is it when you come out the tracks or when you enter the region, you go off into the right area? Or am I just confusing that with a bear? Oh, wait. It was down along here somewhere, isn't it? 
I almost never get that one though. I think I got it the one time and it just kind of uh, kind of shocked me. Oh well. Maybe we won't go and look for I mean it's a, it's a long ways away. I think we've kind of abandoned our trying to get a moose in every region anyways. I don't know. You let me know if you want me to do that though. Your dad just brought up fresh mashed potatoes. Mmm, just added cheese. Yum. Yeah, thanks. I want mashed potatoes now. There's three moose spawns. You think one's one's kind of over right over here, one's across the tracks where I was I think where I was saying. And then the uh the upper the one that's Oh uh, okay. Up in that birch area. I actually wouldn't mind going to that birch area though. There's lots of birch bark in there. Maybe we're not done in this region yet. We're gaining temperature now. We just gotta make it past the invisible bear. These pants, the thing is, these pants plus that, that revolver are going to suck to just lug them around. Hello, heavy. Oh, they're only two kilograms. It's not nearly as bad as I was thinking. Why was I thinking there were four kilograms? Um, I like marking, uh, you know what, I don't care. Let's put you right there. Works for me. Let's go. Yeah, and there are only two, I don't, why was I thinking four? I don't know. Something about them was making me think four. Or something. Yeah, now I I, I kind of do want to go check for the the upper moose over by Hat Creek, whatever that upper area is called. I forget what it's called. Mostly because I just want to go through the birch area. We'll grab some more birch bark. We're not walking terribly slow. Um, we can do that. We can also get rid of the flask if we just go to the camp office. Let's just go to the camp office for now. Although from there, uh, let me think, let me think. Then we have to, cause we're there. Our next destination is black rock, right? So from the camp office, we have to go through the dam and into pleasant Valley. And from Pleasant Valley, we got to go into Timberwolf Mountain. And from Timberwolf Mountain, we're going to have to come. Hmm. I don't, you know what? I don't know if I care about the guns. 
I have to care about them though, right? I mean, I can't just abandon bringing variants to a certain location and it's like, ah, I don't want to because it's going to be a problem. The thing is, do I go to Timberwolf Mountain, get the guns and just come back? And be done with it? Because when we come back from Blackrock, we're going to have the Warden's Revolver and we're going to have the, uh, the Vest. Pretty sure I've checked this out. Yeah. Ruined. I can run. That's good. Yeah, Hat Creek is that way. You're at Timberwolf Mountain at the summit, taking out the ptarmigan. You have three, three groups of them. Run, Astrid, run! Lots of feathers. You were running low, and now waiting for the moose to spawn. Which moose do you have? Do you have the stomper moose or do you have the one out in the clearing? I'm gonna go this way around. I don't like that. You have the one at the clearing. Let's not put that away. Somehow we did not. I'm glad I went around. Where is he? That was weird. Feels like plus three. That's good. Uh, it's just after midday. I think when I do get to the camp office, I think there's a red toolbox there. Actually, I, I'm pretty sure there is. Um, I'm going to make before we leave there, I'm going to make up uh, as many arrows as I'm able. And we will go... Uh, we will go over, I think we'll make a little stop at the trapper's cabin and just see what I have there. Uh, I would like to repair the sled. Now, if I trusted this bear, one thing I could do... You know what? Let's do it. Uh, one thing I don't want to do, I don't want to just throw my stuff on the ground. 
I don't trust this bear. But I can get to the rail cars and I can throw my stuff in there. In the box. Uh, like the pants and the gun. Uh, the flask. And then we can go up over there. Almost looks like a wolf is close by. Yeah, I know, right? That bear was... I happened to be reading your, your comment when that popped up on the screen. I'm sorry. But that's pretty much where we were at. When the invisible bear showed up. Yeah, you win some, you lose some. What the hell? I was wondering, what the hell is that thing over there? It's like a duck. Come on, boy. Oh, I missed. <laughs> oh, well. Oh no, I didn't miss actually. I got a I got a foot shot. All right, whatever. Is that a different wolf or is that the same one? He ran off that way. All right, no shenanigans. None of this garbage about running sideways. There you go. Well, now we have to go look for my arrow. It's out there. Somewhere. Oh, is that a bear? Right there. Yeah, it was weird because I saw it off in here in, in like around the cattails or whatever, but it was tiny. Right? And it was kind of like, you know, I don't know why duck came to my mind, but it kind of looked like a rabbit, but it was darker. And it was, I guess it was just the wolf. I guess. Oh. Did... Did you just hear... A potential bear? Make a... Growling type of a sound? Not, like a... A stomach gurgle? to listen to the crows there he is right there call me crazy huh huh Daddy. Yeah, our favorite glitchy bear. Oh, because I'm up here, he's not going to keep coming this way. Um, is there a rock? Yeah, 
I need a rock so I can uh, get up there and still lure them towards me. There's one. Although now I think he's too close. Watch, I'll have a rock. No, I don't. Well, now I'm going to actually... I think I tried this and you can't. That's why they made it split like that. Oh, that's not even the one I wanted to try. It's actually this one. Oh, man. It looked like he was about to rear up. I'm not going to lie. See, you're not even safe with this guy because... Oh, son of a... Now what's gone? What, what did he destroy? Probably something that I can't get back again. And he didn't even die. There's like two headshots. Ah, feeling faint. I got. Get in here. Bandage up. That one shot was too far back and is considered a hedge or a back shot. You think because two headshots will 100% kill a bear. All right, I never saw, oh, nothing ruined. Oh boy. Nice. Here, I'm sick of this. Uh, all of a sudden I'm thinking maybe we don't need to hunt the moose. <laughs> He's down. He's down. Sounds like he's not too far either. Uh, that's what I was looking for right there. I'll go retrieve my arrows. Uh, he's a little further than I was hoping. 62. Yeah, I have two knives. Is this going to give me that one that's floating in the air? Yeah, it did. How big are you, bud? 26. You're not very big. Oh, and I just literally put that sled inside of the box. What are we at? 31 arrows. Um, you know what? Do I need the cedar? I'm not going to waste the time on cedar. And give me my sled. What's the time? It's almost night time. Uh, this will most definitely not be a, let's try and harvest them without a fire. <laughs> this will be a, let's cook some of this bugger up. Uh, we'll go right here. Where are you? Right there. I can never find that stupid thing. I got to throw something in there. 
and move this just a little bit like right there because I want the fire right there can we get ah we only have one of those Maybe warm and drink some birch. Yeah, I, I want to get a fire though. Uh, we'll throw one of those on for now. And... I will drink a hot one. Take you. I think I have meat on me. What am I doing? I'm crazy. There we go. Fifty six. We'll take that. <laughs> yes, you are crazy. Yeah, I know. Get rid of that scent right there. That is weight. And... Take that. Why do I think we're going to get an Aurora? I don't know. Don't know, but I just have a feeling. Fifty-four. That works. Th yeah, see, you agree, right? It has that feeling. Let's put you there. Actually, I'm gonna put all these inside. Uh, we'll eat that one. And that one. And everything else go inside. What do you got? 52. What's the wind like? Minus 9. It's not that bad. Make sure. At 50 minutes. There's only 18 kilograms. I might just take 9. 18.1. gonna forward 11 minutes while I have all that sent all right, that's an hour that'll work oh, asteroids thirsty okay Take another nine. There we go. We got them all. We'll see what the actual temperature is. If I can get some of that cedar. Over by the rail car. Maybe I'll just... I don't know if I want to spend the night in there. But, I mean, look at where we're at, right? I don't really have a choice. Uh, let's do that, do that. 
Uh, how long is this fire? 57. What do I have for what? 385. Okay, I don't. I don't think I need my uh, my bow out right now. Famous last words, right? Son of a. Is this going to be near impossible <laughs> to get to the rail car? Can we drive her right in? Oh, nice. Nice. I'm okay with that. That, was, that worked fine. Uh, let's just do that. Drop all you here. I'm gonna eat that one. I wonder if I can drop any of this here. Pick you up. I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Come with me. This may not be the smartest thing you've ever seen somebody do, but... Yeah, knifeo being knifeo doing knifeo things. Um, here. I will yank out that. It's loaded. Uh, it's fairly warm. I'm just gonna go. I was considering going to the fire and just warming up a birch bark and drinking it, but we're gonna go to the camp office. That way I'm not gonna burn up all my coal. Fire looks nice in the fog. Yeah, it's kind of cool, eh? This pack is getting too heavy to carry. Hopefully we don't have any encounters. But I mean look at we have we have 23 total flare shots, so I mean we're we're pretty safe. for that murd. Playing the spooky sounds. Seemed right for the weather. The white hair, yeah. Look at the distance on the fire. Is it stupid to walk backwards like this? I mean, a wolf is not just going to come out of nowhere and attack me. It's going to bark. But I'm actually quite surprised. That fire is eight miles away. Oh, copper. Copper's gonna get me killed because she's gonna do that and I'm gonna hear a real one. And I'm just gonna make the assumption that it was copper and I'm dead. D E D dead. Look at that. I'm surprised that thing is still showing up. That is far. There's people who started playing this game that haven't even walked this far.
from here to the fire and died and lost their run. <laughs> Sometimes you like getting many torches lit, throwing them about in weather like this and going for a jaunt the way it looks cool. Yeah, that would. I've never thought about doing that. Oh, there it is. It just disappeared. That's, that's a long ways. I think we're safe. That is a long ways away. That's impressive. Uh, we're at 36. What does that put us at? Puts us at 40. Uh, once we get through the transition, I guess I'll throw the, I'll throw the sled down. And we'll get rid of some of our weight. Oh, he's way over there. I was trying to figure out where is he coming from. It sounded like it came through my left ear cup, but... I need to find some place to escape this cold. Right. I'm not wasting the flare shot just for the sake of shooting. safe though I hope I'm safe <laughs> whoops lazy finger it's amazing when a spooky tunnel is safer than being outside. <laughs> there we go. We're good now. I can barely walk with this much gear. Now it doesn't mean we're safe. Hey, is it like instantly clearer? Wasn't it still foggy out there? I was more focused on the wolf to than to be actually looking at the at the sky. I got a good mind. Oh, we're cold. If I stim, is it going to allow me to run? I have 95 stims. I just don't want to freeze and I don't... Yeah, no, we can't run. <laughs> Why was I thinking I would be able to run? See, that's the thing I keep forgetting about. Like with stims versus uh, uh, go energy. Like, I know a stim will allow you to run for like 92 miles. But how, like if you're overweight, you just can't run anyways. Right? And then the go energy that just gives you uh, uh, refills your alertness. See now this is gonna yeah it it gave us some some health. We'll probably lose the amount of health that it gave us due to the cold and once it wears off and we're dead tired. Oh, I said I was going to. I was gonna throw you down. I literally just wasted the stem there. 
Not like it matters, I mean. Got 92 of them. But had I done this, I'm going to throw you in there. We're still overweight. Had I done this, I probably would have been able to run. Although, no, I wouldn't have been able because I have... I'll be pulling the sled. That's close enough, right? Let's go. I think we're walking faster. I think. Why do I have scent? Damn, get rid of that boy. Okay, let's go now. Yeah, the guts in the hide. <laughs> There's an oops. And stick to the right hand side. Um, can I drink? No, not whilst I'm holding. Get a drink of one of those. Oh, this is the prime time to go to the trapper's cabin. It's never going to happen, you know that? When I desperately need to regenerate the most. It's never going to happen unless I make it happen. Let's go this way. Detour, yes. Now, is this a smart move? I have no idea. Probably not. It's probably the dumbest thing you'll ever see. There's a wolf off to the right. Right there. Hopefully he doesn't see us. Um. I'm just holding my breath here. I got my finger over the H just in case anything barks. Knifeo entering super knifeo mode. <laughs> uh, the thing that bothers me the most is like having two, two of those uh, things in the red. Did I just hear a crackling? Oh, could this get ever even worse? Oh no. Yeah, we got a green bear. Well, luckily we are using the sled so we don't have scent. I wonder when all is said and done if Hinterland changes it so that that doesn't that's not a thing anymore and like even if it's in your sled you still smell maybe just reduces it a little bit there's a piece of birch bark thank you yeah I, honestly a smart person i'm gonna do it i'm gonna stop we're not that far away I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. And... Oh, I just have... Okay. Oh, yeah. 
I need... I only need one, right? Minus six. Um, give me my pots. Oh my god, that's so annoying. When you have the flare pistol out, maybe every weapon. Trying to place the pot, it just, uh, it doesn't do it very well. Oh, damn it. That's one thing I hate about putting my food and water in here is it messes you up. Take that. I actually want to look. Do that. Alright, and I have two of those. Um, I can drop one of you. I want you closer. That's the part that sucks, so I hope when I get there, I hope that... That's point zero one. that's the one. I hope when I get... to the trapper's cabin, I hope that I have, uh... something dry to eat. Let's just take that. Let's go. We gotta go. Before that coffee wears off. Because I need to... Uh, is that birch bark there? Oh, no. I need to... I need to be dry enough that I can... Drink at least a herbal tea. I would like if I could drink... A herbal tea and uh i mean we have some restore condition some birch bark on the go in our body but i would like to drink one of each i don't think it's gonna happen uh what would the driest thing be the crackers i would think right Maybe some jerky. Let me run. Yeah, I got my finger right over top of the H so that we don't have that issue where You've seen me do it in the past where I hit the G. Luckily, I've never had that happen in a panic. You think the crackers are probably the thing that will dry you out the most? I hope so, and I hope I have some. We'll see. So obviously we got some repairs we need to do. Um, we're in a good place though. Let's do that. I'm not gonna be able take to you. For much longer. Take you. Get inside. Uh, let's put that thing away. I think my guts are right in this corner. Yeah, they are. Uh, what does the sled require? Is it one gut or two? I always forget. I think it's one. Yeah, it's just one in a deer hide. I'll take you and I'll take you. That way I can throw all of the rest of you. Right there.
Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I do have crackers. Nice. Oh, yeah. There we go. Uh, do I have anything else? Can I, like, eat some flour? <laughs> That'll dry you out. Uh, that's kind of ugly, having those all just on top of each other. Do that. Where's my deer pants? You can go there. What else did I have? I had spare mitts. Or gloves, I guess they would be. Um... Okay, the small arms book. I'm gonna keep both of those books. I have to keep. I have to keep that on me. Uh, one thing I don't need to do. Uh, I do need these, just so I can drop them. Two hundred and sixty-nine. Ninety-eight of you. Uh, let's throw you down here. Let's tuck you in right there, I guess. I almost kind of want to take all of these stems because it's kind of hard to uh, to get any more in here. And what do we have, like four more? We only have two more to get in there. Whatever. I don't, I don't anticipate finding any more pills. Uh, we got lots of water. <laughs> Merge burn. Uh, what else do I want to get rid of? I don't think I have anything, but I mean, meat dries you out too, right? So that's good. Let's do that. This is the, the sacred bed. So I think that is more important. And maybe we'll get, I don't think we're going to get it all, but Oh, uh, we got half of it. Well, oh well. We still get some restore condition, so that's all good. So I'm going to end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, I thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, please like and subscribe, and I will see you all tomorrow.